Welcome to my unboxing of the Seagate Backup Plus Portable Drive. It is a portable hard drive, which means it uses a notebook drive as opposed to a desktop drive in an enclosure. All right, two and a half inch, not three and a half inch. Easy portable backup for your digital life, for PC or Mac. Now they do have a specific Mac SKU, but the only real difference seems to be included cables as well as the formatting of the drive out of the box. You can actually reformat it to whatever you need, whichever one you buy, so don't stress too much about whether you bought the PC or the Mac edition for your grandson or granddaughter and you're not sure what kind of a fangled computer they actually have. Don't stress out about that. Just go ahead, get the external hard drive and they can figure out the rest on their own for a pretty cool reason and I'll get into that later. Aha! Right there. Upgradable interface. Even if you buy them totally the wrong thing, with totally the wrong interface, they don't actually have to buy a whole new drive to replace it. They can just get a new interface cable, plug it in, and they're off to the races. Social media backup. Yes. What makes this a backup Plus, the fact that it already, with the current Seagate software, is capable not only of backing up things that are on your computer, but also saving photos from Facebook to your drive. So a lot of the time, people these days are walking around with their smartphones and they're all like taking pictures of stuff. This is a simulation. <clears throat> Uh, taking pictures of stuff and they're like, oh yeah, I'm going to upload these to Facebook and so people can like them. And uh, so... What happens a lot of the time is those pictures, if you don't religiously back up your phone, might never even end up on a computer. So how do you back them up? What if Facebook at some point goes IPO in their stock tanks and then they disappear? Um, maybe they'll take all your pictures with them. <laughs> I'm just kidding, that's probably not gonna happen. But if it does, you can back up all your Facebook photos to this drive with an easy interface, so that is pretty handy. Easily back up all of your other stuff locally and to the cloud. Helps you protect all of that good stuff and flexible for all your needs. Mac or PC, I think we've harped on that enough. It's also very slim. So let's go ahead and open it up. You got your uh, limited warranty. There's a warranty on this guy. Two years. There you go. Two year limited warranty. I wonder what an unlimited warranty would be. Someone who knows what an unlimited warranty would be should like post under the comments and tell us about an unlimited warranty. Oh, Slick is actually pointing at something that has an unlimited warranty. Snap-on. Sorry about that, guys. Battery, or rather battery, uh, memory card was full. So, Snap-on tools have an unlimited warranty. I could literally take this thing and like break it over the side of the table and take it to them and they would give me a new one. So there, that is an unlimited warranty. He's right. All right, what do we got in terms of cables included? We have a USB 3 cable. Excellent. What else we got going on here? Well, we have an external drive. So this is a 500 gig drive. However, it is available in a variety of capacities. And we're gonna go ahead and remove the plastic wrap. That is uh, so hard to remove. Ah, there we go. All right, so we got like a matte finish going on on the bottom. We got like a shiny finish going on on the side. We got a brushed finish going on on the top, which looks just deadly. Looks awesome. Can you see how awesome it looks? Slick says no. There we go. That is what it looks like. I'm looking at the camera over his shoulder. Okay, this is what I mean about easy upgrade interfaces. So this is just a SATA interface back here. Very cool. So I am personally a huge fan of their GoFlex. I don't know if they're even, are they even calling it that on this drive? I don't think they're even calling it that, but this is what it was originally called was GoFlex. And GoFlex was just um, swappable modular interfaces. So you go ahead, the chipset actually resides in here. So you go ahead and just click that in there. Now it's a USB 3 drive because you've got a USB 3 to SATA chipset in there. There you go. Take this off, throw something else on there. Maybe you got eSATA, maybe you got FireWire, it doesn't matter. Just clip that on and you're good to go. So that is my unboxing of the Backup Plus Slim Drive from Seagate. Actually here, let's check out how slim it is. So I have a, like a third party external hard drive going on over here. And I thought this one was pretty slim and pretty sleek, so uh, this is a Zalman one. Let's go ahead and have a look. So those are about the same. Very cool. So thank you for checking out my unboxing and first look, and don't forget to subscribe to Linus Tech Tips for more unboxings, reviews, first looks, and other computer videos.